Who was the uh, hardest puncher you ever fought? Ali Fanika hit me with the Ali Fanika left me in pain. In the body? No, in the head. He hit me with my hands up and hurt me. So wait, your hands hurt from blocking punches is? Hands hurt, my elbows hurt, my shoulders hurt. He could punch. Huh. What's this what's the shit the secret of power punching? Is it the the tur the torque? What? The torque is big. I'm a torque puncher. I'm a torque and speed puncher. Mm -hmm. Ali Fanique is a snap puncher. I have store, I have everything. I have torque, speed, and snap on my shot. Ali Fanique just has snap. Because he punches from so far outside. And it, it gains a lot of momentum from A to Z. A to B. Boom! What's the difference? Nothing. It all fucking hurt. <laughs> Teddy Reed, Teddy Reed is the hardest puncher ever was hit by though, period. Teddy Reed. He hit me with an 18, 18 or 20 ounce glove on, and I heard a high pitch squeal and a low pitch horn at the same time. So this was in sparring? With a head gun. And you heard the zzzz? Ah, mm, at the same time. Shit. Did you get the uh, camera flash? The ksh. You know what I'm talking about, the flash, oh, right? Oh, yeah. Call it in. Oh, yeah. He didn't hit me. He hit it me. He hit it? <laughs> he punched it at me. He punched it at you. Did you, feel, did you feel his punches in the body, too? Like on the shoulders and elbows? He, I didn't let him get that close. He clipped me. And I, he clipped me with the box. He went uppercut to the middle of the body and lifted me up off the floor. What was his weight class? 140, 147. Damn, he had that kind of power? Dude, at, from one, at 140, 147, he knocked out, cut, and stopped everybody from 175 to heavyweight. In South Florida. That was far away. Stopped him. He didn't just stop, he cut. Busted up. Split up. Ruined. Heavyweights. Shit, that's a... Well, do you see a puncher that has that kind of power today? Like, because back in the day, right, you had your Ernie Schaefer's, you had your Julian Jackson's. And right in our gym, we had, in our gym, we had Tarver, Cedric Boswell, um, me, Angel Man Freddy, Teddy Reed, Sean B. Mitchell, Mike Tyson came through, Arturo Gotti, um, David um, Estrada, so you had a Big scope of guys coming through. Mm -hmm. Ricky Keelis, Demi Lane, who could punch. That was a, to this day my cousin. That, to this day I tell me and my me and my cousin Eugene Eugene Howe will tell you that's our favorite white boy ever. Jimmy Lane. Oh, favorite one of my favorite people. But of white guys that box, he was it for me. Yep. I love the ball. You have a spar with him? Yep. Hard puncher? I didn't find out. I closed the gap on him so fast it scared him. He said he never had anybody close the gap on him that fast. Yeah. I closed the gap from from six feet away. I was up on him before he knew it. <laughs> I knew if he hit me on the end of something, he could hurt me. So you had to smother him? I didn't just know. I, I had to get close and fight my fight ain't close. I couldn't box with him out down the end. I'm going to tell you, it can hurt you. Randall Bailey and me was far with it, and he hit me with a right hand. I told him, well, all right, motherfucker, let's go. If there was a different, I changed the complexion of everything around us then. He hit me with a right hand. I wanted to bite, I wanted to, I wanted to bite him on the, bite him on the, bite him in the face. That, he punched that hard? Yeah. 